Or maybe he's tied down, I don't know. Too bad there's nobody in there with him. Why is that a too bad scenario? Shouldn't he be alone in there? Oh my god, I have unmatched strength. Did you see me kick that chair? Hey everybody, how's it going? It's Ryan here. We're doing Resistance 3 Let's Play. I mean, we're going to be doing a cooperative playthrough with Brandon. You remember Brandon? Hello. Hi. <laughs> how's it going, Brandon? I'm great. I just yeah, yelled great. at him because he doesn't speak loud enough into the microphone. So we're going to do a co-op playthrough. We're both on the menu separately, so I'm going to invite you. And I'm not even signed into PSN, so i got to block that information right now. <laughs> oh, this is going well. I didn't even agree to the uh, terms of service. Invite me faster. I'm trying. While well, you're starting the new game? Difficult. Yeah, don't set it to difficult. Where it's like, where it's like impossible. Set it to down. normal. Okay. <laughs> I didn't even brief you on the entire game. Oh, yeah, I was gonna say I don't even know what's going on. All right, just watch this. I killed Nathan Hale. I had no choice. He was becoming one of them. He could have stopped me, but I think he wanted to die. At least that's what I keep telling myself. Even in death, Hale continued to fight. Dr. Malikov found a unique protein in Hale's blood. He isolated it created a vaccine. Finally, a cure for the Chimera virus. We were all inoculated, saved again by Hale one last time. Hale was the hero, and I was the villain. of the world's population had been killed or converted by the Chimera. Those of us remaining did what we could to remind ourselves we were human. Susan and I found each other, fell in love. We both wanted to forget the past. We vowed to stop fighting and start living. I kept that vow as long as I could. That's deep. Okay, so... Why have I never heard of this? I don't remember this at all. Resistance games? Yeah. Very big on PS3. Hmm. Well, they didn't sell that well, but... They're big ex exclusives that Sony touted. Oh, oh, so you're Joe. Joe. Who am I? John. I'm John. John. Let me see on your screen. Oh, Looking look pretty cool. spiffy with those, uh, what are those, like, leg warmers? Are those your socks? What, that you're, that I'm wearing or you're wearing? You're wearing. What am I wearing? Look at that. I can't even look. see. I gotta look at your screen. Look. Oh, those are dope. Yeah, I don't know. So, Resistance. You don't know, you haven't played the first, th the first two games. No, so, you know, I didn't even think about that. Okay, so Resistance 3, the Resistance games is about uh, the, the Chimera are aliens. They attack Russia, and they pretty much take over most of Russia. They move into England, and Resistance 1 is about you, you, you play Nathan Hale, and you're in England, and you're fighting against the Chimera. Oh, this is a cute dog. And then in Resistance 2, um, you... Nathan Hale gets stationed in America, and then he tries to defeat the Chimera in America, and they pretty much kind of lose, and the beginning of Resist Resistance 3 is um, Joe killing Nathan Hale. So you're playing the guy that killed the first two games protagonist. Oh. Yeah, so... In so I'm like the hated... Well, I mean... The hated person. No, because 3 puts a new perspective on, on Joe Capelli, because... 
At this point, Resistance 3, 90% of the population of the world has been killed off, so you're just uh, dancing and living underground with everyone else trying to, like, make ends meet because it's like you're not going to win against the Chimera. Like, you're just not going to win at this point. So you're just all living underground trying to hide. And... Why, why, why is that happening? <laughs> I'm not even doing anything. I'm just moving. Oh, you're, well, it's probably your analog stick. Well, that's dumb. It keeps doing that. Okay, well, that's your wife, so... Right there. This one? The, the, At the table? Yeah, that's her. Susan. No. Nope. What do you mean, no? Mm. I'll take her if you don't want her. Divorce. Okay. We had a journal. Usually, she's supposed to be saying stuff. I've beaten this game twice, so I know what's supposed to happen. But oh. I've never... I've never played it cooperatively, so I don't know if, um... It, you know, the game operates a bit differently because of that. Oh... What? I'm gonna go this way. I mean, that is the way. That, that is the way to go. So. Oh. You wanna wait though? He's creepy. Who? Got a. He's got a really big forehead. He's got a really twisted face, to be honest. Yeah, maybe that's it. Maybe that's it. See, so wait, where are we? We're underground, and we're. This is just. This is our new life. I mean, we can't. The Chimera are too powerful at this point. They've killed off too many people. So we're living underground just trying to survive. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Because the first two games, you're, like, in the middle of the war. Like, the military still exists. Like, everyone's trying to fight back. But it just gets to a certain point where the Chimera just took over too much. And how the Chimera operate is um, they convert humans... So they'll capture a human, and they'll get the Chimera Plague, and then they'll turn into a Chimera. Oh. In fact, in the Resistance lore, we actually don't know what the real Chimera look like. Like, true Chimera from their home world. They usually, like, get... Home world. Yeah, they use, like, the Chimera that we'll see and fight against are kind of like human hybrids that were, that were converted. So it's sort of zombie-y. No. Well, in the sense that, like... Well, like, they have to convert them, like, in, like, conversion centers and stuff, because it's, st oh. it's still very sci-fi, you know, kind of. Here's Dale. He's going to give us a weapon. You know, I have an uncle named Dale. Oh, that's nice. Did he look like this guy? I mean, he's still alive. But, but no, he doesn't look like this guy. <laughs> okay. So we just picked up the Magnum and the Bullseye, and these are both Chimeran weapons. Because, you know, we're humans. We're fighting against the Chimera... But we do pick up, you know, we learn their weaponry and we learn how to use it. So get in the shooting range. Am I there? Uh, yeah, we're going to start learning how to shoot. Oh. got to get used to training. Yeah. You're, I mean, you're you're rusty on this stuff, aren't you? Like what shooting? Yeah. Well, I mean, I don't, I don't usually, you know, go out and with these guns and shoot. If that's right. what you mean. Well, okay. So each Chimera weapon also has like a uh, a side, like a, a special ability. That's, How do you do it? It's gonna teach you in a second. Oh. Oh, John. John. You hit four more than me. Well, maybe you, if you were a little bit faster. Well. What are we waiting for? It's it's asking me if I want to end practice or keep practicing. End practice. Oh no. Oh yeah. See, it doesn't teach you. Looks like I'm just gonna have to learn. Well, I'll tell you real quick. Okay. So uh, I think it's R two, but that's your secondary fire. So the bullseye, for example, it will tag a person. And then you don't even have to look at the person or aim at the person. Like, you can shoot it wherever you want, and the bullets will follow them. Oh. And then the magnum, you, like, shoot it, and, like, then the bullet will be stuck in a wall or a chimera or whatever. And you can keep shooting them, and then when you hit R2, the rounds will explode. And you'll, I'll explain the other weapons uh, secondary as we go. Oh. But most chimera and weapons will have a really weird sort of side effect to them. Special ability. So we're going to follow Susan here. Jump, crouch. Come on, come on. 
I love you, how you just have a gun pointed at everybody. Well, I guess I do too. <laughs> I don't want to stop moving. <laughs> it's the analog stick, Brandon. It's like sticking. I said, do you know what's going on? Um, um, uh, something's going down. So uh, some chimera are walking above ground, and they're kind of searching around town, and we don't want to get we don't want to get caught. So we're gonna go investigate with this guy over here. Over here. Oh right, yeah. I don't know. I don't. I... L three to sprint. So what is <laughs> you just like flip so, over you? So what is this? Like an extended video game teacher? Like I gotta teach you everything? Yes. <laughs> there they are. Get down. Get down. They're out there. You see them? Oh, that's them. That's a stalker. Oh. What does circle do? Crouch. Oh right. <laughs> They're out there. If you can see them. See? There's one right there. Oh, he's like looking in here. Yeah, might want to get in this hole. Shit's going down. Shit's going up. We going up. How do we go up? <laughs> Let him go up first. Oh. <laughs> yeah, see, he's waving us through. We gotta be quiet. Shh. Well, seeing as Shh. I. Shh. Do you really want the chimera to kill us? Like my guy won't stop moving. It just just keeps moving. So what just happened? Why'd they do that? Do what? Why are they freaking out? Because the Chimera are walking through their town. Oh. And now we just got discovered. And now we don't care. Yeah, well, now, now we gotta defend. They know where we are. So, all hell breaks loose. Be sure to try out your secondary. So these are standard Chimera and foot soldiers. They're called hybrids. And these all used to be... Most of these Chimera used to be humans at one point. Which one's your health bar? Uh, bottom left. Oh, okay. And this game doesn't have regenerative, regenerative health, so... You gotta watch your health. And there's a stalker. How do you get that? <laughs> a stalker? Yeah. You don't. You fight it. Well, that's what I mean. How do you, how do you, how do you kill it? Well, it's got a shield up right now, so we need to toss a grenade to take its shield down with L2. You can unleash a little bit of some fury. Fury on it. Ah. <laughs> okay, he's definitely working on you right now. Yeah, don't throw those until his shield's back up. There you go. See, he's almost dead. See, with two of us here, we're going to get this game done pretty damn well. Is it like a short game? Uh, it's about eight hours. Oh. <laughs> but I'm saying, like, we're going to get through this no right, problem. Right, Is right. he missing a fucking leg? That doesn't look right. No, he's got No, legs. he's got him. It's, wow. Uh, it's wow, how he, wow. When he, the way he walks is weird. Is he, is he dead? I don't know. He's about to be. Oh, he's shooting. There we go. Yeah. It looks like you lost some health, Joe. Oh, I guess I did. Oh. Yeah, you gotta watch. You gotta look for health. How'd I get back? I just got it back. You picked it up. Oh. Get him out of sight. And get back underground. Everybody. Oh, no. All scouts report in. Who's on post? Clear. South outpost clear. West outpost is Tommy Dean, report in. Tommy Dean, do you read me? Susan. Joe. Oh. I thought I lost you. 
I'm okay. How is he? Oh, fever's down. A little. Joe. I can't reach Tommy Dean. His radio's probably out again. Should I send Lester? All right. I'll check it out, okay? Joe! Be careful. So you see, this game's kind of got a little bit of a soft side. This is one of the more darker... I mean, yeah, I, it seems like it's going to be really, like, emotional. Well, yeah. Well, that's what it's all about, because mm -hmm. we're, again, like, we're, we've pretty much, humanity has lost. That's what 3's all about. It's really dark. Like, this guy is about to get amputated. Uh, yeah, probably, if he got bit. If he got bit, or if he, like, he got swarmed or something, or if he's, like, turning. Hey. 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 So, see, the thing about Resistance 1 was Nathan Hale got infected, but for some reason he was a little immune to the to the virus. So it took until the end of Resistance 2 for him to finally turn, and that's when Joe, who is you, killed Nathan Hale. Oh my god. Holy shit. Are you aware that you're like... What is... what? You're like all over the place, dude. You can like fly and stuff. Was I? Was I like in the air? I if you, if you look at my screen, you can see that you were you were all over the place. You were flying. Is this guy dead? What? What are Who? you? Hello. Hi. Hello. Oh shit! Look at the, look at through here. What's going on in there? I don't know. This guy's like having like a seizure or something. Maybe he's turning. Or maybe he's tied down. I don't know. Too bad there's nobody in there with him. Why is that a too bad scenario? Shouldn't he be alone in there? Oh my god, I have unmatched strength. Did you see me kick that chair? A chair? No. You kicked a chair. A note from John Harper. Ah, chairs. Ah. Where are you? Oh, follow me. There's this door. You're not just supposed to point your gun at everything. I don't I don't even I have my understand. gun. I don't even have my gun out, do you? Yeah, yeah, you do. Yeah, well, yours yeah, you do. Yeah, but I'm saying like physically I can't I can't shoot anything. Ooh. Oh, a, a drop ship's coming in. Hey, man. Ooh. Taking a bath. He's giving us shrapnel grenades. I took them. Oh. Press left or right to uh, swap through your grenades. Oh, I see. And then you've got a weapon wheel. Hold triangle to access it. You know it gets serious when your gun actually comes out. And I notice you're not using your 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 weapon wheel. I did. I I was looking at it. Oh, well, cause, cause you can get your magnum out if you want. I don't. I don't want. I'm saying you can use that some of that explosive. Oh, why did I just do that? Explosive travel. You still have... Yeah. <laughs> Nobody was even on the ground yet. Wham. See, look at me. I'm using my magnum and I'm blowing the fuck out of them. Aren't you jealous? Not really. Even though you have a magnum? My TV's too damn loud and I keep lowering the volume, but I have to raise it again because when we get to a cutscene. Then a cutscene. You can come down here if you want. I'm not feeling very good about going down there. Man, this game actually looks really damn good. Still holds up nice. From 2011. Oh, you're almost dead. Yeah. Guess I'll have to be the hero. Save me. It's about time one of these Let's Plays I start looking good. I always die when I'm playing by myself. <laughs> I do. I die all the time. Well, here you go. I'll make you look really good. <laughs> He's down, I think. Maybe. I don't know. Be careful. Should be some health. There's health over here. Over there. Wh where? You're just doing circles. <laughs> there's one right there. Okay, got it. There's, there's some over here, too. Pick that up. Pick it up! I'm walking. <laughs> Run! You click L3, God. There's a lot of health out here, actually. I don't know where we're supposed to go. This way? 
No. You've only played it three times, it's right? A I played it twice. Oh. But 2011. Got that platinum trophy. Oh, do we go up here? Uh, no. Nope. No, that would not be the answer. Maybe it's not oh, in this, there. This garage door, how about that? Oh, where the thing says come to it? Waiting for partner. Hey. There we go. It's so eerie in here. Oh wow, there's like, follow a ton of health and shit. Follow Tommy Dean. Hey Tommy. There's a storm coming. A physical storm? Yeah, if you want to call it that. Some chimera here. Should we kill them? We're gonna have to. I think you can sneak this part, but good luck trying to do that. <laughs> why are you throwing a, why are you throwing an anti tech grenade? That's not gonna do anything to them unless they're using like shields or something. Wait. Do you have any shrapnel grenades? It says I have. It says they were full, but it's. But that's what I threw. Switch oh. your grenades. I think I just used the last of that one. Oh well, there you go. There I go. I also like how this game takes place in like sort of like a lot of uh, states that have like a, a good countryside. Right. Yeah. It's it's very. Uh... Well. Resistance 1 and 2 mostly took place in England and uh, America, and there was a bunch of tall buildings and stuff. I'm scratching my eyes right now. I probably shouldn't be doing that. Boy, oh boy. Tell me I'm crazy. This is taking a while. So, you aren't in the cutscenes? I guess not. Such a hero. Dropships are headed toward town. Hurry. I know I incoming. You hear that, Brandon? Dropships. Dropships. You know what dropships do? Drop. They drop other. Do they drop other ships? Yeah, they drop Chimera and sol soldiers. Now that's oh. a Goliath. Oh. Goliaths are like giant stalkers. Not, I don't think I had to explain that to you. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! I was I fell behind. Oh my God. I don't even know where I am. Is that is that you? Where? That's you. Yeah. Where am I? You just keep running. I don't, I don't know. Are you watching me? Yeah, I'm following you. You're following me. Yeah. I think I was too far behind. Where do, we, um, where do we go? Well... Where do we go? Oh my god, I feel like this is going to be the, the question of the game. Where do, where do we go? Where do we go? Oh shit! Where's that? It's in this room. I don't oh. know if you want to be here though. Ugh. Oh my. Oof. She definitely Rough. lives in middle America. Rough. She probably just put on her glasses too for the day. Oh, we're waiting at this door with Tommy Dean. He's so heroic. Yeah, but I'm the real hero. Yeah, well, let's not get ahead of ourselves. I done not I mean, you are though. You are Joe, so. Uh oh. It's an auger. His stuff goes through stuff. 
Yeah, so I forget the name of what that chimera is, but the guns they use is called the auger, and the auger can shoot through walls. And when we kill him, we get his gun. So we're going to want to do that promptly. Right, right, right. Like before he kills us. Yep. I threw a grenade. Where is he? Uh, oh, he put up a shield, but he's dead, I think. No, he's not. Mm. Alright, I got the auger. <laughs> do you have one? No. Go get one. Oh, wait. Maybe? Is, is this Triangle? One? Do you got one now? I don't know. Hold oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah I do. So hold tr hold the L1 and then you can see them through the walls. Oh, oh, and then you could just shoot them? Yep. Pretty badass, right? That is pretty badass. I love how they just, like, fly. Who flies? No, when you shoot them, they, like, fl fly to the left. I don't know what you're talking about. They sh they fire. No, they like when they die. When who dies? When they die. The chimera? When they want the chimera die. And they they start dancing? <laughs> sort of, yeah. Slide to the left. Eh. Slide to the right. Eh. What was that song? Uh, the electric slide? Or no. No, 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 no. That's the electric slide. Is it? Or is it? Is that the other I one? I wouldn't know because I don't know anything. Well, that's great. Alright, there's some chimera here. And I'm gonna kill them. I killed them. I got credit for it, too. Good job. Oh, shit. Woo! Woo! There's a lot of health, like, everywhere. Well, it has to do it because... I mean, most first-person shooters, like, you always have regenerator of health... Regener I can't even say the word. Regenerator of health... Oh, my Regenerator. Regenerator... You have a regenerator. Regenerative health. In this game, it doesn't. So, they have a lot of health drops everywhere. I'm okay with that. But if you play if you play on the harder difficulty, then there's not as many. Aw, oh, he's dead. Ooh, that's... Wait. Oh. I'm gonna say... I'm gonna say he's not gonna pull through. It's a, oh my god. What? He just got kicked across the room. Who did? This thing. Oh, uh, my screen he didn't. Oh. Well, damn. Well, damn. It was entertaining, so... You missed it. I can just watch it when I'm editing. True. This is an excellent place for the auger, because there's all these, like, houses and stuff. You feel me? I'm feeling you. Yeah, let's just follow me, you know? It's not like it's a big open area where you can go wherever you want to go. I didn't realize it was, so... Well, it is. I'm going to go over here now, because you want to be a copycat. Good for you. Yeah, like, good for me, because I'm going to be indep independent. You know, whether Nobody you cares about your independence. You know, whether you like it or not, Brandon, this is like, you know... Like, the world's almost over. Like, you're stuck with me whether you like it or not. Not really. In the cutscenes, you don't even exist. Yeah, that was a thing with Resistance 1, too. But whenever there was a cutscene, like, when me and Terrell used to play... we, Me and Terrell played Resistance 1 co-op, and every time there was a cutscene, he was never there. I'm bleeding like, out! You're dead! I didn't realize he was right next to me, just shooting me. Oh, there's a lot That's of camera why. over here. What are you doing, man? So whenever a cutscene was over, Terrell would be like, where the fuck am I? And the best part is, the second person in the Resistance 1 co-op was black. So he was... So it was Terrell. So yeah, so it was Terrell. <laughs> it was very accurately Terrell, but every time the cutscene was over, he wasn't he wasn't in the cutscene. He's just like, well, where am I? Like, that's racist. <laughs> like, I don't know if it's racist. It's just you're a fallen soldier and you're like well, a ghost. Well, why does it always have to be the white guy he's in a, the Well, he's a ghost. Scene. Following through the, uh, following through. Strong black protagonist CJ from San Andreas. Or Franklin Clinton from GTA 5. You need to find some health because you're about to bleed out again. I know. Let me go look. Yeah, you go do that. 
Joe. Joseph. Oh, I thought this was a chimera. I don't know what he's shooting at. I'm standing right in front of him. Just as I say, there's health everywhere. There's no health. It's probably because I picked it up. <laughs> and I don't even need it. Brandon, would you get up here? I'm doing all the I'm, I'm doing all the heavy lifting here. Well, do it. I am. I'm, well, keep doing it. I am doing it. I need it. help. He's like standing right in front of me, and he's not even doing anything about it. Oh, there we go. Health. Are you coming up here? I don't know where, where you are. You? I'm kind of low. I, I'm actually pretty low on health right now. Ooh, can I go in here? I cannot. Ah! Dun, 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 dun. So nice of you to join me, even though I'm, they're already all, they're all dead already. Oh, good job. Actually, we're supposed to go follow Tommy Dean. He's over there. Oh, he would go through there. I was just up there, too. Don't worry, guys. I'm coming. <laughs> oh, Jesus. He's all the... Oh, Wait, no, where he is up there. He's up here? No, I think he's downstairs. No, he's upstairs. You let me know if he's up there. Um, he's up here. Okay. I'm sort of. Right, yeah, well, he's up here. What do you mean, sort of? Yeah, he's up here. Okay, I'll meet you there Around the corner. Oh, shit. I think if I don't get there fast enough, it transports me. Yeah, you just me. tell it. Yeah. Hold square. Yeah, I know. Health. Ugh. It is a war zone out here. How do you feel about the Chimera? Sort of dicks. I think this game would have a lot more impact on you had you played the first two games. Because <laughs> playing the first two, it's like a full-on fucking military war where you control tanks and shit. And there's still a lot of soldiers around. But, oh. like, yeah, shit's fucked. But not here. No, not here. We got a wife and kid. We're just trying to take care of them. Thanks, Joe. You got here just in time. Where's Susan? Last I saw her, she was near the bank. Scrounge for weapons and ammo. Then get back to town. There's more of them on the way. Joe! Susan! Is Jack okay? Yes, he's in the tunnel. Get him. Grab all the food, water, and blankets you can carry. Lester, barricade that street. Chimera ground troops will be here in a few minutes. We'll have to hold them off till the rest of the town evacuates. I want to know who got us into this mess. I like the colors. God damn fool, you let him right to us. Still have the anger issues, I see. What's going on? Nothing. Just a crazy old man. Joseph, you must listen. When Nathan detonated the bomb in Mexico, it acted as a catalyst. Power surged through the Chimera Tower network toward New York City. There, it activated a bridge through space and time. What they call a wormhole. Its purpose is a mystery, but its effects are clear. That tower in New York is slowly freezing our entire planet. I've been trying to find you for months. We're moving everybody upstate. We might have room for one no, more. No, you don't understand. I came here for Joseph. We must travel to New York City. We must shut down the tower. Not a chance in hell. Temperatures are dropping faster. We, we will not survive the winter. <coughs> Any of us. Show more drop ships in the main street. I'll be right there. Joseph, I'm the only man alive who knows how to shut down that tower. I need you to protect me on the way to New York. You want protection? Here.
shit. Yeah. Follow the tunnel under the church. I'll be right behind you. I'll call you and let you know when everyone's out. Don't wait for us. You and Jack get out of here. Promise. Come on, Joe. Let's regroup. Let's regroup in the so that was Dr. Malakov. And he's he studies the Chimera and he knows a lot about them. And he wants you to go to New York City to shut down the tower in New York. Because it might stop the, uh... My screen crashing. What? <laughs> I'm, like, glitched up. Oh. Aw, uh, shit, I'm frozen. Where are you? I'm over here. Oh. Frozen. John. <laughs> well, this is great. Seriously? Yeah. Oh, this is excellente. 